Hi everybody. Mature Simmer here. So we're back here again. Round two. Going ahead and seeing what we can do in the Genesis. We know we're not going to make the cut. Like that's impossible with that kind of a first round. So just uh, trying to get my swings in and try to find a way to stay consistent. Sports and the PGA Tour proud to bring you the season long race for the FedEx Cup. All right, less win than last time, so that's good. I am not going to hit a driver because I didn't carry it last time. I'm certainly not going to carry it this time. I'm Luke Elby with my mate Rich Beam in the booth, and Beamer, this player really hasn't been getting it going in this tournament, finds himself trailing the lead. All right, your expectations of them today. Good Certainly shot off the tee. That's always nice. This might work. So we're going to get a little bit, get on the green, and then we might have a roll. Again, I think the five wood would have been too much. So... Just try to visually see where things are. It is a long putt. Let's see. Not quite hard enough. Good look at birdie here. I was trying to be careful that I didn't go by. I've never been disappointed by starting off my round with the birdie, Luke. I can tell you that. All right. So we we've got that. I've never seen a golf course where you're so happy to start off <laughs> birdie bogey. It's the strangest thing I've ever seen. The second hole, pretty straight away off the tee shot. The oh, no. Shot no. From left to right All right. The hill. At least we got out. I'm like, that is going to be miserable, but that worked out okay. Hard enough right to left to get back on the green. It's a sensational second hole. Okay. A uh, little bit up on the hill. That'll do some weird stuff, I'm sure. And choosing the All right, the fast is not helping. Be careful out there, it's danger. It's heading left, isn't it? Playing their All right, if shot. I go here, that's going to take me down almost 12. So this might actually be all right. We're going to slow it down when it hits. Just try to get it to just stop. All right. Because, yeah, otherwise it loves to just roll right off. So I guess I'm doing birdie bogey, like you said, that you, I should be happy, right? I'm not. Moving down the leaderboard after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. Okay. Less wind, less wind. Looked like they were swinging a snake. They took too long. We ended up on the fairway, but again, we're such a long way away. It's just not a good, not a good look. All right, let's see. Are we gonna? We'll hit the fairway. Where are we gonna end up? Well, we ended up. Wow, we. Wow. I don't know if that was downhill all the way or... But that was a lot. Alright, slow down. Of course it would have been nice, but it doesn't happen that way. Right over the spot they were looking at. All right, we got our par. 
That's like what I've been doing. It's like my second rounds I start out well with again. And I've talked about like the psychological game in my head that it's almost like I, I know I'm out of it and so I'm more relaxed and I do well. And I, I don't know if there's any truth to that. Well, it could come up short in that bunker, and that is a And again, I'm not doing incredibly well, clearly. Um, but I just tend to do better than I did in the first round. Um, seven. Because, yeah, this would be 60. Uh, maybe that is enough. Try that. Yep, it should be. Okay, I'm glad I pulled it back, because otherwise I would have really driven it too far. For a par now. Hmm, yeah, that's a long way. Thirty-two feet. Let's see. Not gonna move. And short. I'm trying to adjust my uh my stroke a bit, and I'm not sure that it makes sense. Because I, I seem to keep drifting by the, the whole 10, 12 feet all the time. Um, I think I can carry this. They have to be mindful that the fairway pitches significantly from right to left on their tee We'll shot. find out. From there, they're hitting their second shots downhill again to a green that well, chases away from Kind of worked. It's like a bad mini golf again, course. A simple looking second um, shot, but a difficult one to get close. Okay. So I'm going to pull this back and back. Uh, we've got a little bit there, so that should be good. Okay, let's get those two and again, Timing and tempo. we work on it, Getting and then we take a shot, there. and we, we just don't know because we get crap results like that. Ooh, that almost went down. Four feet to the cup. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. There's always a sense of excitement right. striding onto the tee of a par three hole. What an incredible or foreboding this is. Right? And it really just takes this green and it makes it into a section of four. The back right, the front right, Let's the front see. left, and back. We're right. at they the pin, but right, it bounced all off a bit. Is due to the simple fact that, that bunker, which is tiny, minuscule, almost not even there, it basically shapes that green into the four quadrants. It is just an amazing design. <sighs> It was hard. I knew it was going to break a lot, but it was like, how much? A little more than I planned. Right. Just going to do a little bit of that. And so players want to try and hit it out towards the far right part of it. Ah, in the ravine. Ooh. It's even worse. It would have been better if it was like in the middle of the ravine. 17, 22. Alright, I'm going to go up one more. But I am going way over here. Wow, that still wasn't enough. Just hoping for an outcome now. Do you think they drew that up differently in there? Alright, that was actually okay. God, this is horrendously... Just look at that, how it runs from the hole. God, I would just love for it to go in, but it's not going to. He has this putt to save his putt. Oh, can I do it? All right. Wow. That was a rough, rough hole. <laughs> Two great shots are required here because this hole is a long par four. All right. Just it gets really, really tiny for the landing zones. Alright, I suppose if I had to go in one direction, that's the way I'd go. 
from around 180 yards out. It is uphill. Just huge tears. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. So we'll Club see up. how things like end one. up. Uh what is it doing and where is it going? Okay. Need to make a long putt to secure a birdie. Okay. What's in front of them, Henny? It's gonna break right away. This will be a good one. 41 feet. Let's see. Hmm. That was a gallant attempt. It was a gallant attempt. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. He's got this okay. for his part. Well played hole, I think. I'd say that was good. Here we find ourselves on the tip of par four. Only the big hitters are going to be able to carry that fairway bunker down the left-hand side. Most players are going to try and avoid it and even miss ah. it. Out to the right -hand I side. thought about it as I swung because it felt off. I, I could like again. On the front right part of this. I could. Is not the place to miss it. Anything that's mm. a little bit long will leave you a downhill putt, but that's I didn't even think that that would come into play, and, th and that again is why I struggle, because, yeah, there's no way I can do that. I don't even know that I can do this. I can't. God darn it. They got that one a bit heavy, but the green's still in sight. All right, it's uphill. Looks like they've got the five wood. So I'm gonna hope that we get it to slow down some. We do. And again, we got a crazy bogey here. Oh yeah, this is Come on. Alright. And that goes down for a bogey. So all in all not not a terrible result with how that started. I don't think they're nervous because they're so far out of it. It would take a miracle for them to make the cut. Yeah, that's it's not wrong. That's kind of where I'm at in my head. We're gonna eh, we'll be short of the bunker because we hit the Second the rough. On the tenth hole. All right. Problem is, is that too much? Because that's 11, and then maybe 15, so that would take me to 40. So yeah, we're gonna go down here. Hmm. And the 106 obviously carries it like that. Oh, I thought that one was going in. I just wanted it over the bunker, is, is what I wanted. Okay, steady now. I really didn't think that wouldn't move at all. I, I did not think that was going to be the case. This That's why I was fully at the edge of the cup as I was. Because I wanted to give enough room to move back and, <laughs> and be that. good. But now we're double bogey. This one's for double. And this is again where I need to stop because this is then what happens is things start to fall apart and they keep falling apart. Okay. Too much of a move to the right. You must avoid that bunker front right at all cost. That is deep and nasty. Wow. Another swing to the right. That swing didn't deserve a good reward. Just nope, it did not. And here we are with the third shot. All right, can we get over the hill? We can. So at least we're on the part of the green that is that the hole exists on, and we're not having to cross some crest or something. Now go back. Oh, Just not enough. Opportunity to make their path. 
Welcome to this hole. That's a par four. All right. This is where the golf course gets. This is long. Difficult, Luke. This tee shot moves from left to right, but massive overhanging. Okay, I'm continuing right to side, swing to, from a to high the right. Over him. Once you're in the fairway, though, your second shot is to a green that's really not as big as it should be for such a long hole. And there's a famous um, tree just short and left of this green. Bogey's tree. 36, 50. Bogart used to sit there and yeah. just watch everybody butcher this hole. Uh, I was going to say, I started out well. But I'm butchering it on my own for sure. Oh, some smiles here. A bit of luck in the second cut. It's sitting nicely. Okay, we're up. They're a long way from the hole here. Work to be done. This is huge for momentum. Gotta try and hold this. This for par. Obviously, we always try to hold it, but. You know. It just doesn't just go that way. Nine feet to the cup. Oh, that's a nice line. All right. The leader now has a one stroke. Just advantage. still trickling strokes away. I mean, it's certainly so far a better round, but. It's really cool. This tee shot is framed by large eucalyptus trees, both right and left. All right. Better swing path. Nothing else that was really game. what I was focused on. Right to left off this tee. If you do it correctly, well, that golf ball could chase down there miles down this fairway. If you find the fairway down there, you're going to love the okay, second again, shot. Good Difficult swing path. When the pin is all the way that is a left. very, it's, it's like threading a needle. A bit left there. So, not bad, honestly. A bogey or worse. All right, a little farther. It's just hard on those short ones that are barely 10 yards. It's just much harder to to do it. It's not going to go. That line was looking good, wasn't it? Six feet remaining to the cup. They'll be happy to get this in the hole. It's for bogey. That's a bit long there. Looks good. Come on. Three feet to go here to the hole. And again, these stupid yeah, triple bogeys and stuff like Our that. Leader is enjoying a one -shot lead. Wow. Time to get this train back on the tracks. They need to focus here and get back into the game. They hit a seven iron, uh, a high little draw seven iron, and two hopping right in the hole, Luke. That's what I suggest. That makes it easy. All right. Well, it rolled in the right direction. What's he got in front of him here with this putt? He's got to be careful. This doesn't get away from him here. This is downhill. Ah, it it did look good to start, and wow, that's misjudged. Then it just took off on me again. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead, teeing off here at the 15th hole. It's a great par four, and yet there's some players that have seen it a little bit differently lately. I always saw it as a dog leg from left to right, just avoid that fairway bunker down the right hand side. Come on, wind, move green. over. It's All right, well, we carried it, thank goodness. Middle section and a high section on the right hand side, and you never have a flat putt. It is always breaking one direction or another, and it's either straight uphill or straight downhill. This is the most right, difficult going up on one. Of course by a long margin. If you see it differently, you can hit it down the right, down 17 fairway, but I fail to see how okay. that's any get kind of... Get me close, thing. get me close. Wow. This needs a little right turn. <sighs> this putt is from 14 feet. He's not kidding about nothing being flat. Man. Ooh. It's a gallant it's attempt, a as always, right? It's my story. Chance. Gallant attempts. Was on a good line. Let's move on to the next. Stepping up to the 16th tee now. It's an island green, if you can believe that. It's surrounded by bunkers. I think this is another one of the all-time great yuck. designs. It's only yuck, about 160 yuck, yuck. yards, Luke. 
but the whole green is surrounded by bunkers. Everything feeds towards the center and the front of this green once it gets on there. I just think this is a magnificent design. If you hit it in any one of those bunkers, making a par will be nearly impossible. What's in front of them, Henny, with this part? Yeah, guys, he's looking at around 17 feet. It's way downhill. Oh, I don't think I hit it hard enough. Look how that went off the blade. I'm not quite reaching to the hole there. Downhill putt, and sometimes you think it's going to run out more than it does. That was nuts. Out this time. And there's always the so I don't know that I would have made it anyway with the way that went off the blade. At all costs, do not hit it in that fairway bunker down the right hand side. I'm Eight going right for it, I'm sure. Even in the rough left yep. is just fine. <laughs> From there, your next shot should be laid up out to the right hand side. Third shot straight back nah. up the hill with some kind of wedge. I would it love to try the driver, but birdie if you get the distance on your third shot spot on. If you get but at it wrong, least however, we got it out with the four iron, so well, that was a good strike. It was pretty well played out of the fairway bunker. All right, I'm going to go up there. I think that should be pretty good. Ah, too slow. Stay on the green. All right. It's not really the green, but... It's it's there. Let's see. Nope. This putt's about four feet from the hole. Again, look how fast it's moving. Wow. All right. That's I'm like, awesome. if that didn't go and it like still pulled, I give up. Nice I don't know. Leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. This hole is a long par four. T shot up the hill is long. Significantly from left to right, missing it out to the right is a massive no no. You'll be blocked out by a bunch of right. eucalyptus trees that you nicely get struck. Through. Second shot is to a green that actually tilts away from the players, not towards them, even though the second shot is uphill. Green is historically one of the firmest on the right, golf course. I'm going with this. Is nearly impossible. It is a heck of a finishing okay. hole. Well, it's an actual shot. Let's see. Eh, it's going to dump me off. But yeah, not, not horrendously so. 18 yards. So there was a lot going on there. He's got a par part here. Let's see if he can make it. So far, so good. All right. So still a plus ten, but really around a few holes. So, I mean, it wasn't great, but I mean, it was more than a 50% improvement well, from the first round. Was not their best. It's a miscut. Luke, I hope we would see this group rivalry play out over the whole event, but this player couldn't even make the cut. That's yep. Extra hard. You should say it that way. Just dripping with contempt. How can I even be in the circle of these folks? Wow. So, I do not remember the Emory Beach Club. I don't remember a lot of these, but just still a tough season. Enjoying the play, but it is uh, difficult. So, as always, uh, if you wouldn't mind, if you haven't given a like, uh, follow, a subscribe. Those things are greatly appreciated. And I will see you next time.